Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even Hey guys, it's Anna and welcome back. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you a typical day in my life lately because it's been a while since I've vlogged and also the last time I did this was at the beginning of lockdown when everyone was in quarantine. So obviously my daily routine has changed a little bit since then. As you saw, I just got up and did some stretching and planned out what I wanted to get done today. And I need to go take a shower as well, but I'm starting to get hungry. So first I'm going to make some breakfast and I thought, why not show you guys what I'm making? So I'm going to have some coconut yogurt. And in this, I like to add a spoonful of Tropica's salted caramel lean protein because not only obviously does it add protein to the yogurt, but it also makes it taste really good. I've always liked this kind, but recently they changed it a bit to make it creamier. So if you're looking into getting a protein protein powder. I really like this one from Tropica or I also like their vanilla protein as well. So I'm just going to mix these together and then on top I think I'm also going to put an apple and some granola. Before I get in the shower, I know I always get a lot of questions asking what hair products I use. And if you're new, you might not know that I've been using Function Beauty products for over a year now and I'm obsessed with them. So I wanna say thanks so much to Function of Beauty for sponsoring this video. In case you haven't heard of Function of Beauty, they are the number one custom hair care brand with over 18 hair goals to choose from. And they also offer the best value because they have the lowest price per ounce compared to other custom hair care. What I mean when I say custom is that you literally choose everything from your hair type and hair goals, the color, the scent, and even the name on your bottle. Not only does the shampoo and conditioner make my hair feel really soft and shiny, but I also have their hair serum and their hair mask, which to be honest, I don't use every time that I wash my hair. This is my second one of the hair mask, and I do really love this, and whenever I use it, I feel like my hair is extra conditioned. And the hair serum, I just got a week ago, so I can't really give my full opinion on it yet, but I do find that it makes my hair extra shiny. Like always, whenever I show products that I absolutely love, I try my best to help you guys out. So if you're interested in trying out Function of Beauty, you can get 20% off by clicking the link in the description. And now I'm just going to take a shower, so I'll talk to you guys afterwards. I just got myself ready because I'm going out to this business course this afternoon, but I have a few hours before I have to leave for that. So right now I'm going to start editing the first part of this video. I'm a bit of a perfectionist when it comes to my editing, so it takes me a bit longer than some other people to edit a video, which is why I only upload once a week. But sometimes if I can get a video done really quickly, then I'll upload a bonus video. I really do love editing though. It's probably one of my favorite parts about doing YouTube after being able to help you guys through my routines and tutorials, obviously. So that's why I prefer to edit my videos on my own instead of getting an editor to do them Even though that would probably be the more efficient option I love the editing part of YouTube so much that sometimes I'll even lose track of how long I've been working on a video Until my eyes literally start burning and then at that point I have to like go outside and go for a walk or something That's just not on my computer. I obviously haven't filmed this entire vlog yet though So I think I should be able to get the first part done pretty quickly And then once that's done, I'm going to read through some emails and also your comments on Instagram Instagram, YouTube, and on TikTok. I know a lot of you guys send me direct messages or emails, and if you've done that and I haven't responded, I'm so sorry because I wish I could see them all, and I really do appreciate all of your support, but there's just so many messages that if I were to respond to all of my direct messages, it would literally take me all day, every day. So if you have any video requests or anything like that, just comment them on my latest video or on Instagram or TikTok because I do try to read the majority of my comments, but if you send it as a 
direct message, I probably won't see it because unfortunately, even though I wish I could read all of your messages, I just really don't have the time to read them all. So comments are the way to go. I just finished editing the first part of this vlog, reading your comments, and also answering some emails. And I still have a bit of time before I have to leave. So now I'm going to go take the thumbnail for this video. Personally, I like to take an actual picture for the thumbnail because I find that looks a lot better quality compared to just screenshotting a part of the video. So how I do that when I'm at home alone and I don't have someone to take the picture for me is I put something like this where I want to sit in the picture to focus the camera and then I set my camera on timer and just move the object that I focused on out of the way when I take the picture. It's never ending. You can give anything to you. I was trying <laughs> I was trying to click the button on my camera <laughs> After several different attempts, I think I finally got a thumbnail that I like, and now it's time for me to leave to go to that course I mentioned earlier. I don't think I'm going to be able to vlog much while I'm there because I don't want to be putting a camera in everyone's face, but I'll try my best to get a little bit of footage and then talk to you guys when I get back. So I came home and there was two parcels at my door. One is something that I ordered from Amazon and the other one is this ginormous package from Gymshark. I personally love watching unboxing videos so since I'm vlogging today anyways I figured why not open these up on camera to show you guys what I got. Unless you're new you probably know that I'm a Gymshark athlete so whenever they launch new products they always send them over. I obviously know what's in the Amazon package because I ordered it but I'm not completely sure of what items are going to be in this Gymshark package. So I'm going to start with this one Okay, so there is a ton of stuff in here So I'm just going to go through everything like really quickly. Okay, so first off we have this bomber jacket Which is so cute. I honestly don't have anything like this this purple crop top these leggings Which are so bright they kind of remind me of a highlighter But I still think they'll look really cute in pictures these navy blue flex leggings this gray flex sports bra, purple leggings to match the long sleeve crop top, and I love this color so much, it's so my style, and also a matching purple sports bra. Next we have another crop top like the purple one, but this one is navy. Besides the bomber jacket, I think this sports bra is probably my favorite out of this package so far. I feel like I'm going to wear this all the time. And I also love these gray leggings because these will match so many things. And the last item in the Gymshark package is this navy blue sports bra. Okay, now it's time to open in the Amazon package. Why is this so hard to open? <laughs> What I got from Amazon is these color changing LED lights because I was on my TikTok for you page and I saw someone do a silhouette kind of video where the lights kept changing colors behind them and I thought it looked really cool so I wanted to do something similar. So I'm going to go get changed into one of those Gymshark outfits and then set these up in my white room to try and do that TikTok.
been making that TikTok. I just ate supper with my family. And in case any of you are wondering, no, this is not a what I eat in a day video because obviously I didn't film everything that I ate today. But I know a lot of you have requested that before. So if you'd like to see that kind of video, just give this a thumbs up and let me know in the comments down below. I think for the rest of the night, I'm just going to edit some more of this vlog. So if you enjoyed, please subscribe. And don't forget, once we hit 2 million subscribers, I'll do my first ever live stream stretch and Q&A. Bye!